feeling of justice and raw emotions demonstrated in the grieving process of Orestes. Greek theater was challenging for me because growing up I've always been taught to act like I would react truthfully in real life. But with Greek theater you have to act as if you're performing for 20,000 people. An actor must be larger than life. Every movement needs to be completely intentional, but it took time to remove the fidgets. But doing Greek theater is extremely helpful. Once returning back to more familiar contemporary acting, I feel like I'm overprepared. All my fidgets are gone, projecting comes naturally, and I'm incredibly intentional with every movement. And so dies the tangled tyranny of Argos. They murdered my father, seized the kingdom's bounty, proudly usurped their thrones. Now, here they lie, lovers still embraced in death. Double oaths were sworn to kill my father, to love each other even to the grave. Both oaths are honored. Do you require evidence? Look, here it is, the trap they used to ensnare him. Here were his hands fettered. Here his feet. Unwrap it. Unwrap it, gather round it. Do you see this father? Not Agamemnon, but the bright sun, who is father to us all, who sees all as we mortals do. Do you see this? My mother's most unnatural crime. Apollo, god of the sun, stand as my witness as this act is tried. I killed her in the name of justice. But not him. Not a justice. His death was the callous fate deserved by every adulterer, condemned by every law. Yet, my mother's heart was nourished by hate of the man whose children she bore in her womb. Love yielding to hate, hate yielding to revulsion. Just touching, not even biting, poisons and putrefies. Oh, that monstrous, savage heart. What name shall we give this? Give me a name, an innocent name. A trap for a wild beast. A shroud to wind round dead man's limbs. A web, a hanging gown to trip a man. A ruse a robber might employ to amnesh a traveler and rest his wares. A villain's contravance to murder people and then revel in the crime. She did it. She was guilty. This is my proof. Bloodied by just this sword with the passage of time, death discharge has rotted all this gorgeous cloth. Oh, Father, now must I weep. My hands hold this bolt of bloody cloth. My heart howls for what is done and what is to follow. A victory. Most hollow. Thank you.